Welcome to Empire Blizzard Rampage and welcome back to my Esmethon Draken campaign for Warhammer 3 and Immortal Empires. Where we're going to continue the film from last time where I am trying to rescue Balthazar Galt and make sure he does not die at this point in time. Elspeth, right now, uh, we're going to be able to push into Fu Hung here pretty easily. I think we're going to start, like, actually, I, I think it'll be easier for me to, like, burn areas down and then keep pushing so that way I can keep Elspeth using Elspeth more. Because otherwise, if I take Fu Hung right now, I'm just going to be stopped there. So I should be able to... Yes, I can. Um, I'm going to grab... Actually, no, this guy's a level 10. You know, let's try and grab you. Shall the Empire. Marius, let's grab you. I'll grab you. You'll be the one that uh, the, we'll start gathering these wizards around. And I possibly will lose the uh, Temple of Elemental Four Winds. That's fine. I'll come back for it later. Uh, but basically, we just want to make sure that, for like, for right now... Let's just hit Fu. Uh, this we can just auto-resolve. That's not uh, that big of an issue. Auto-resolve that. And then I want to actually just raise it. Yeah, just, just, let's just raise the area. That way we still have my movement range. Or I don't get all my movement range. I thought I was going to have more of my movement range, but okay, that's fine. Basically, we'll be trying to make my way over here now. Uh, I'll have it so that Marius here, next turn, you'll start making your way down. You'll just colonize Fu Hung, give that over to Balthazar Gelt, and we will keep trying to just keep giving him land over here to strengthen him, and to just try and... I, I only want this one territory. This is the only territory I want, because I still want to make that Doom stack. I, I really want to try and make that Doom stack, because for the most part right now, the, the only thing like we're trying to do with this campaign is the, to finish it off. I want to finish up the Imperial Gunner School. I want to be able to get everything here. I want to be able to get everything here and here. I just really like the idea of us trying to do that. Um, unlocks the land ship. We still need to get upgrade our thing. I mean, we need to use the spirit barrage ability, which is this one, which I probably should restock it at some point, but for right now we're not going to. So we'll hold off on that. Jagan, you're still making your way down because I want to have it so that you're going to be trying to deal with uh, Ikit here. So keep trying to make your way down this way. And then this army over here, I know I was starting to move you down. You're trying to make your way all the way over to Sylvania so I can get you all the steam tanks that I need to get in this army. Next turn, I'll be able to get more um, of the steam tanks for the electric count units. So we'll be grabbing that. Uh, rank ups, though. I see Scotty. Scotty at the moment. Uh, you can get better mentor right now. And then Theodore, I'll uh, have you also get mentor as well. Because that should technically, I'm assuming, just affect like my captain, guys. I'm assuming. So that's what we'll go with you. Uh, you keep keep just grouping up with him for right now. Keep just grouping up in this army here, basically. Keep trying to do that, because I don't think I can... Yeah, we don't have any more of them right now. Next turn, I'll have some more. Building-wise, let's keep trying to improve my economy. So doing anything that will improve my economy, basically, right now. Everything else will kind of hold off on upgrading for right now. Let's see, that's just all the fences there... There's some economic stuff here. And then I will have you get some defenses around here. Get that. Fort Soul, we'll leave it as it is. This I do want to upgrade, though. So we'll try and upgrade that. You guys are... Let's see, because we need five. So we're, we're getting there. We almost have enough stuff. Um, I'm actually going to have just keep having more of a surplus. Because I, I don't feel the need to upgrade specifically anything that's for defenses or military buildings right now. Like, I don't need to do that. So we can just keep saving my money. Well, hi, guys. Uh, let's see. So you've got two armies here attacking. You have so many spearmen. What is this? What's the terrain? This is going to be a slaughter, guys. Yeah, you can you can try. <laughs> you can try to attack Elspeth here. It's not going to fucking work. My army is just so fucking strong with her right now. I love it. I was actually thinking that technically the doom stack I want to make with all the wizards might actually be stronger with her. Simply because she already has a way to increase her elemental mastery. But then again, it is capped at like 200%. You can't, I wish you could increase it further. Because I know there's like a there's an army that I can make with um, Kairos. That's kind of a similar idea. Where you just max it out. you uh, And it can get up to 200%. I wish it could go higher. I do. But then it'd be broken as shit. <laughs> Absolutely. Because if each person can get 20%. Like you only need in reality 5 wizards. And then you can max it out. Like, that's it. Like, that's kind of sad. Because, honestly, I'd, I'd love if it could be higher. But, you know, let's just get set up here. Group up. Group up. Group up. Because I'm just going to sit back here. They're the ones that are attacking me, so they can be the ones that have to make their way towards my army. Feel free, you idiots. So, like, right there, right there. Hellstorms. Oh, I actually can't push you the way I want you to. 
I need to move you guys forward just a little bit. Move you guys up. There we go. You guys go there. Cav here. I probably don't even need any of you guys, but it's just to be uh, just to be certain. Then we'll put you guys up front to distract. There, 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 and Elspeth! Cause let's just watch you destroy the entire enemy army with just hellstorms. Cause I love the range we have on these. Like, what's, what's the fucking range on these guys got now? Yeah, 528 on almost every single one of them. Their entire army is already almost dead. God damn it. Yeah, victory is in all grasps. We just started the fight. God, it's so mean. It's just so mean. I love it. I love this army. I absolutely do. And then this guy's going to try and fight Elspeth, which he can try. Elspeth's a, somewhat of a decent combatant if I'm fighting against somebody and I make sure to use her magic on top. Oh, yeah, they're doing their cast stuff on top of my uh, Hellstorms. That's fine. Yeah, just keep focusing down on the Lord here. And then I'll just keep casting into them with Elspeth here. Do all this stuff too. Because yeah, the Lord's almost dead. Once the Lord is dead, then everybody else is going to be pretty easy to deal with. Because, like, yeah, you guys are getting some decent shots in here. Elspeth can kind of tank those for a little bit right now. Let's see. So, there's a lot of spears. That's all there really is here. But keep fighting there, Elspeth. And then try and get these Corsairs. Yeah, because he's running. Hi, guys. Yep, I've already almost destroyed your entire army. Then we can take advantage of the AoE. Like, I haven't even been able to get... You guys are not even going to get close enough to be shot at, except for, like, maybe by these guys. Like, here comes the reinforcing army. Um, at this point in time, let's see, Elspeth has been able to get 600 kills already. Like, the harpies are coming on in. Rest of their force... They just have a ton of harpies. Like, that's the only thing they have, like, with this army, specifically. I might as well have you drop some stuff there. Because I'll lure them back now. We can kind of lure them closer to my guns. Like, if we just sit around here... That'll be the perfect range, because the only damage they've really done for this fight has been the stuff from their core, uh, their Black Arc. Otherwise, nothing else can really do enough damage to actually last against us, because they can't get past Elspeth. Because yeah, I do love having these guys in the army too. We don't need a ton of you, we just need really one of you to just snipe people as they try and make their way over to us. Because yeah, Elspeth, just keep healing. Just keep luring them over towards us. Like, they're trying to get to us. It's just not really working. <laughs> I love these fucking things. I can't wait to have more of them in my army. I was like, yeah, you guys can try and shoot Elspeth. I can now just make sure to cast shit on you as you're uh, making your way over here. Yeah, because I like, charge on in there. Get some AoE here. Get some AoE around here. The Lord as well will want to try and hit them with some casting in a second here. Oh, they're just hit army losses. Nah, it doesn't matter. Beautiful. I love this army. Like, they just can't even... I, I haven't even been able to properly get all the cav I want here. Honestly, I think I might just get rid of these. And just make them more hellstorms. Because they can't get to melee with me. They, they just can't. And I love it. I think I should at least have two units of cav. So maybe one more hellstorm. Because what I could do... Because uh, I'm finishing up the research right now. That's going to let me have three more units of amethyst units in my army. Um, I think what we'll do is I'll replace this guy with another Amethyst Ironsides. So we have five of those. Then we could have it so this one will be replaced with an Amethyst one. And I could replace one of the guns with an Amethyst uh, Hellstorm rocket battery as well. That way I've got three Hellstorm rocket batteries in her army uh, that are Amethyst ones. And then I've got at least, at least two units of Cav so that we have something... Because they can like, kind of just join on up with uh, Theodore at all times, basically. But for the most part, like, just more firepower. I just want more firepower. Uh, we're already replenishing, so I'm not going to worry about that. Uh, I'm probably just going to get more money, I feel like. Because we're going to pretty much already replenish. Nah, just get the replenishment. If it was more than a thousand gold, I probably would have taken the money. Yeah, let's see. Oh no, an ambusher. I think you died. Let's see. So you guys... I need one more fight to just make it so we can max ourselves out for the uh, Nemesis Crown again. This is besieged. Not surprised by that. It's just sieged by Skaven slaves. I really do need to make my way back over. Honestly, I feel like I should just leave you here for right now. Just as a way to guarantee... Because I can have you sit here. 
I can have you try and recruit that. I, I, I do at least want the one Demigriff. Because then the other guys are actually really easy for me to get for into Elspeth's army. Because then she can just automatically recruit them in immediately. So for right now, uh, just keep grabbing more, more of these guys. Let's see. Up here, I need someone to level 5. Finally. Final supper. That's not what we want. Let's see. Elspeth here. Let's have you get rid of the Black Ark first. Oh, close victory, my ass. No. <laughs> There's no way in hell this is a close victory. So, let's have uh, let's get rid of this Black Ark first. Then we can go kill the other army of theirs that they have. Um, or the other two that they have. And then, uh, for the most part... If I'm going to leave that one other guy by the Temple of Elemental Winds... Or, or by Gelt right now, just to keep giving them support... I might just have it so Elspeth could possibly colonize Fuhung. We could just do that. We do that, give it back over to Gelt. I'm going to get replenishment around this area anyways because of my uh, tower right now. So I'm not too worried about that. Because let's get you guys set up. Let's see. So we'll kind of be angled like this. So right there. Group up, group up, group up. I don't like that we're downhill, but it's something... So you guys here. And if anything, it's going to be the Hellstormers that do most of the damage. So you guys there. You guys off to the side. Hellstorm rocket batteries. Yeah, because if I remember correctly, it's the... Yeah, these are the ones that have even more increased range. So if I make every single one of these besides this one, basically, an Amethyst Hellstorm rocket battery, oh, that's going to be great. That's going to be absolutely wonderful. I didn't need to put you guys all into the same group. I meant to just get rid of guard mode. There we go. Um, yeah, Elspeth, you'll be pushing forward. These guys will just be watching forward in front of my troops in case they make their way up. I don't know if they will. They might. But let's start the battle. Elspeth. And I think I can actually move this force. Uh, we could move you forward a little bit more. Hellstorm rocket batteries could just stay where they are, but I can put you guys to, like, here. That way, if they come down towards us, they'll just be shot at. Like, I don't, there's, I don't know why the hell they think this is going to be a close victory. There is no way. There's no way in hell this is a close victory, given what our t power I have at my disposal in the form of our literal artillery, and then also in the form of just casting with, uh, oh, accident. I thought I was casting that, um, with uh, Elspeth. Because I love how cheap this thing can get with her. It's so cheap. Now she is taking a bit of damage. Yeah, she is a little weak to range damage. That's one thing that's kind of concerning. Like, she, she she can do a lot of damage, and honestly, I should get her out of here. And get one of my heal things off. Yeah, let's get her out of here. Get her out of here. Just keep letting the uh, Hellstorms do the thing. Yeah, Hellspell needs to get out of there. She can take way too much range damage. And I do love that they were focusing their damage of their arc stuff onto these guys, because they just don't die. Um, so for right now, yeah, you guys advance towards me. That's fine. I'm just going to let Elspeth just kind of keep her covering. She took a lot of damage from all that. So just get them in range and then they just don't die from my guns. God damn. It's just not fair. God, I can't wait until I have even more of these guys in this army too. Like, the only thing that's still alive really is, like, the Lord. Like, he's kind of still up there in health. Everyone else, not so much. Let's focus you, you, you... Yeah, my guns are doing good damage, although some of you aren't. Let's see. Let's try and get you guys in melee now here. Specifically, actually, in melee with people. Elspeth, we can get you back in here now, I think. Focus on the Admiral. Focus on him. Because once he's dead, they'll give up. Because at this point in time already, they're not doing the best. Let's see with that. Use your Dragon Breath on as well. And then, yeah, there he goes. He's already getting knocked down and dying rather nicely. Yeah, the amount of damage the uh, the Hellstorms can do is just a beautiful. I love it. I absolutely love it. I, I do get a little too cocky with Elspeth, though, because she's not an amazing melee lord. She's not. Keeping her as like, just a mounted ca uh, caster is by far the best way to use her. But no. If I get two more Hellstorm rocket batteries... Okay, if I upgrade you to an Amethyst one, you are replaced with another Amethyst, uh, Amethyst one. This army is going to be really disgusting to try and fight. It really is. Like, these guys already, because they just don't die unless you deal 50% of their health, they can tank a lot of damage, which is pretty nice, and, like, recover pretty much, uh, pretty instantly. Which I love. 
So yeah, there is now one Black Ark dead. We'll be, get pretty much almost all my recovery from the uh, post-battle loot. And then I should be able to... I think the, the remnants of that previous fight should be able to hit those guys. Yeah, so we got the replenishment. Yeah, get everybody else back up. And then I should be able to hit you guys, I think. He's not fully dead. I'm keeping the crown. <laughs> Monster's crown. <laughs> God damn it. He should have gone over my beer again. But you know, I, it is now starting to give uh, chaos corruption in our territory. Uh, but I want it. It's mine. I have to get seven battles. And get it up again. Victory carried on the winds of oh, that's when it rank upgrades to rank three. 40 to 80. The amount of damage that does is ridiculous. Okay. You know, Elspeth. Elspeth. Oh, she doesn't have enough Draken. movement. Oh, I wanted you to finish those guys off. Okay, I'm just going to have you... Yeah, just colonize this for right now. I don't have enough movement to move anywhere else, so just colonize that. Um, I'll give the territory over next turn, because we don't have to worry about that for right now. Uh, rank ups. So for Scotty. Let's see. Scotty is almost to the point I can finally put him into... I just need to get the leadership, and then I'll put him on auto-manage. You can get extra powder. You can get more replenished troops. Von Draken. Yeah, you're almost... Almost to the point where we're putting him on auto-manage. You just need... Now, I'm just gonna do... Actually... You know, at this point, I'm gonna put you on auto-manage. You're good there. Wielder of the pain. Theodore, I need to get you some more speed. Uh, this is Marius. He's the one that... I guess it doesn't really matter what you have. That's the other thing. Because you're just going to be using just Hellstorms and Mages. <laughs> so, that's fine. So we can just have you do that. Let's see. You're acting as the agent. And then this is the guy... You're the one that had the scope ability, right? Yes, you did. Yeah, you were the one that finally had the Hotchland Scopes ability. So you, I actually do want in an army at some point. Because I've got one of you guys so far. I'm trying to find more people with that. None of you guys have it, so I'll just recruit you Engineer. randomly and disband you again. And we'll try again next turn. Keep trying to find more of those. For right now, though, let's see. Building-wise... I do have a decent surplus of money, so we could start upgrading this stuff. I do just want to focus mainly on my economy. I want to get my economy doing as well as it possibly can. And then we... Ooh, here we go. So you guys... Let's see. Again, we need to make sure we keep upgrading my wizard stuff. And then... Besides wizards... I should just get some defenses here just in case. Just grab those. Grab the basic things there. Don't need to upgrade stuff there. Don't need to upgrade stuff there. This I do need to upgrade, so we'll get the wizard stuff. Because yeah, we got everything else. I will upgrade this so we can get steam tanks in Dragonoff. And then nothing here. Middle Mountains, we do want to grab more growth, more money. And then this resource, we can hold off on that. We'll get defenses first. Border Princes, I can upgrade you. Get some basic defenses, more growth. That we can hold off. And then again, this we're just going to give over to Gelt immediately next turn. So I'm not going to put any money into it, so that's fine. Um, I do have... I almost have enough. I need... What was it? I need 4,500 for this. I, I really do need to get uh, somebody else besides just Elspeth fighting things. And that's why I want to keep fighting more Skaven, because they just Master give me so many schematics. Engineer. So that's why you're trying to make your way over down here, Jurgen. So I can finally test you out with your tank. Because you're doing that, and then I have my other army... One, two, three, yeah, you're going to get there almost perfect timing to be able to then start building uh, some steam tanks over here. I do hate that I'm probably going to have to seal the crown next time. Seven seven fights in three turns, that's pretty damn hard with uh, whatever I'm at currently right now. Elspeth right now, though. Oh man, did I just see that many orcs over here? Holy shit. Yeah, you guys are pretty strong over there. I might need to send Jurgen over there to help you guys at some point. Let's see. So for right now, though, it's going back over here. So Elspeth, I do not have enough movement over for you guys there. I don't want to hit this area. They have, they're still sieging me. It's going to give up next turn. Um, Deathmaster's making his way over here. I'm here with this army. I do need to go up and around because I need to be able to like connect this land so that I can gift this over to Gelt because 
I want to keep this. This territory I want to keep for myself, so goddamn badly. So that probably means I will probably want to go... I'm going to go over here for right now. I'll go over here, try and make my way to hit this territory, hit this territory. But for now, let's give Gel... Greetings in Sigmar's name. I want to give you Fu Hung. Just, just give that to you. And then I'll have to see... Uh, I have to double check, because I know I'm going to try and give you like these two territories over here. So these two territories I'll try and give to you. I basically have to like try and go up and around. For right now, basically I'm just going to hope that you staying around here and supporting these guys will be enough to try and help them. And then wizards keep trying to just get more of those to group up in this army. Um, and then I, for right now, just to make it easier to help defend this area, I'll just grab you guys and honestly, probably some regiments of renown so we just have something more in here. Because like, why not? Just to make sure that like you guys don't lose this area. Because eventually I'm just going to replace this with other shit. But for right now, that's an army. That's an army I can use to make sure that you guys do not Rock lose this stuff move. over here. So you can do that. You'll keep moving around here. And then, let's see, Jurgen. I still don't think you have a movement to hit them just yet. No, you don't. You're still making your way over here. You're almost here. You're almost a Skaven Blight. Because I, I want to make sure we'll take Skaven Blight. And then I'm just going to try and take Estalia all for myself. So I want this for me. So we'll push on over for that. My army up here is still making their way over. They're almost here. I can at least now, well, once they're my own territory again, um, I can try and have you grab another one of these guys. So to wait. I have to not be in Force March for that, though, sadly. So we can do that next turn. Pick it up next turn. Building-wise... Okay, there we go. So you guys already have that. Don't have this. This. So you grab that for some more money there. Force of Gloom still waiting on growth. Nordland, you can get a little bit more money. Northern Sylvania. Yeah, because we have a little bit of an excess, but not an insane excess. Okay, you can get... Let's see, get this. And then I'll probably have you get the defenses there, the basic ones, and then that's all you guys can give right now. Rank ups. Um, This guy, just get the... Hounds. Actually, no, upgrade your Searing Doom ability. And then that's all for you guys. He's tempted to ask for a peace treaty. Not unless you guys actually uh, accepted a peace treaty with Gelt as well. So no. Because I'm going to keep pushing into you a little bit longer. I need to push into more of your territory. They should have just taken my city there because I didn't sally out. And that's fine. We'll, we'll make our way back over to the Temple of Elemental Wind at some point. But for right now, we just need to keep trying to delay them. Until Elspeth can basically loop around and take all the land she needs to, to give to Gelt. Because it's easy. you, I need to remember to make sure to take you at a force march stance. Walk normally now over here. And then I can now actually get you this guy. Because I want to make sure we restart, uh, reset that immediately. So you can try and get more stuff. Yeah, surrender imminent. I thought that was supposed to give up this turn. Oh no, it's this, this next turn. Okay. Aw, that's my ally there. Broken lands of tiny. That's... Yeah, the rebellion area is, a, is the temple. So I'm not surprised by that. It's sieged. So that's fine. You know, let's just keep pushing on in here. These areas are pretty easy to take. And then just occupy it. Occupy that. And then I will just move out of the territory. Because we want to try and go to Bamboo Crossing next. Try and go there. Give this to Gelt again. Oh, I cannot give that one to you. I hate that. Uh, I think I have to technically give you this one first. Uh, that's annoying, but that's okay. Because this area will... They'll be fine. They'll be fine for long enough. I just need to have it so that Elspeth makes her way up here, takes Bamboo Crossing, then I should be able to give him Bamboo Crossing, then give him the the village. So that's what we'll have to do there. And then... Uh, rank ups for you. Get him in for a hunter. I almost want to have you just be on auto-manage. I just want to get the cleanse corruption stuff first. Let's see. This is the steam tank army. I'm going to have you try and upgrade that first. Um, let's see, so Purifying Flames, Flaming Attacks, Snipe, Way of the Wolf. Oh, probably... For loss production, lose magic for enemies. Um, I think I'm going to give you this one. Make you unbreakable. No, actually, no, you should be range damage. Range damage if we have all the tanks. So there you go. You, Scotty, then. You're almost there. Oh, actually, I should upgrade your uh, speed first. Von Elvis Drake. Presley. You can get that first, and then you're on auto manage for everything else. 
Okay. Back over here. I need to get you guys another wizard. Let's keep just joining them up there. Yeah, they're kind of backing off of Gelch, at least for right now, which is exactly what we want. Back over here. Well. Uh, the dwarves are losing there. That's not what we want to see. Okay. I'll start pushing forward. Oh, Ryan's down here too. Oh, interesting. Who else supposed this do for this? Nice blazing sun, control faction. Well, it would be nice to get that. Yeah, because it's only going to really be like we have to just take this one city, because I think it's just Skaven Blight. This stuff... I don't believe that's under... Con yeah, that should be... Pr I think it's properly burned. Yeah, the Rebellion's actually going to honestly help us more than hinder us, because it's only going to spawn... Yeah, it spawned and then they died immediately. So, that's fine. So they looted that. We lost that territory for right now. That's okay. As long as our allies are defended. But yeah, like, honestly, like, this point right here, this is as many wizards as we need for this. And then everything else is going to be... Like, I probably don't even need this. Because at most, again, I can only double... Um, well, actually, it depends on if it is 20% per for this. Because usually... It depends. I'll just see what, like, once we actually have that. But for right now, though, Elspeth... Um... Interesting. That didn't go down. Um, you know, keep making your way over here to the bamboo crossing. I still need to try and get over there, and we should be able to hit that next turn. Because we want to make sure that we can... If we get that territory, we should be able to gift it over to them. So, do that. Back over here, though, I think we can hit Skaven Blight. Indeed we can. Let's see. Lose one halberd. I'm pretty okay losing one halberd for that. That's fine. So we can just take that. Then I'm going to have it so... Oh, there's so much money. I'm going to loot and occupy this, honestly. It's actually worth quite a bit. Because I, I do want to keep this any... Si oh, that, yeah, that was the last settlement there. Beautiful. Yeah, because now... Um, what the hell is with this setup? Uh, demolish that. We'll keep that. Well, actually, for the corruption reduction, we should keep that for right now, at least. We'll keep it for now. I'll get rid of it later. But, yeah, no, get. try and just give me another halberd. Let's replace the one we lost. And then... Orion took that. Ah, oh, you guys are taking stuff around here. I want that. God damn it. Okay. For the Empire. Well, I will say... Let's have you... We don't have your red line stuff maxed up yet. So, for this army here, I should upgrade the cav. If you want it done right. Yeah. Get you guys a better charge bonus there. Charge bonus more speed. I'm okay with that. Burdened with brilliance. Let's see. Um, let's get you some more health. Imperials let's get Gotrick, more defenses, because he still needs to actually max this stuff out. Work Felix, um, yeah, we can hold off on that stuff for right now. Let's keep getting some more defenses here. Oh, Rika needs to do more of her own personal line. So grab that, and then she'll be able to get Bludge Forged next turn. And then that's for rank ups for you guys. And with us sacking Skaven Blight, we have a lot more money now. Again, we only want to upgrade my economy right now. Everything else will just kind of save my money for later. Like this, I want to keep upgrading. I actually do need to remember. Back to the gunning school. You can now get this. Bound in metal. Now, these fuckers give me winds of magic. Which is beautiful and disgusting. And honestly somewhat stupid, and I love it. But uh, I can't wait now to try and have it so... What I'll probably do now is I need to save up like what... About 4,000 again to get the two I want from this to be able to put into her army. So, yeah, something like that. Hello, Wolfric, once again. God damn it. This, I keep just slaughtering you. I almost feel sorry for this at this point in time. I'm going to fight this because we are in territory that we won't get replenishment in right now. So, we want to make sure we minimize casualties the best we can and get the most out of our replenishment. And they're, most of their army is just spearmen. Like, that's it. Like, you guys, no. <laughs> no. I. I can't... This isn't even the final version of this army, and they already have a hard time destroying this force. Oh, actually, I need 6,000 points, actually, now that I think about it. I need 6,000 schematics, because we need about 2,000 per, and I need three more guys. We'll, we'll make sure we get the Hellstorms first. They'll be the first priority, because, like, this guy being a normal Ironside, that's fine. But, yeah, let's get you guys group up back here. So, get over here, over here, Hellstorms. Have you guys, yeah, like right here. 
Try to make sure you're not going to actually shoot my own units. Like, just put them between you and that. You guys, I'll say over here. You guys over here. And then Elspeth kind of in front once again. Theodore. And then everybody else in front to distract as we wait for them to advance onto us. I will be able to at least do some good damage with Elspeth. But for like right now. Uh, actually, I can't really hit them at all that well. So I sniped the guys. We're now going to have it, so let's pull back. Let's lure Loki over here to get destroyed. I turned off my Hellstorm rocket batteries from auto-firing, because I want to make sure you guys don't accidentally waste your ammo. Oh, stop there. You can't get any closer. Elspeth, keep pulling back. Keep pulling back. Just keep casting into him while you're withdrawing from this. Because he, he will win in melee against you. So just kind of pull back for right now. Keep casting into him. And just lure him over to my gun line, and he's going to get fucked. Let's see you. Would you kindly accuse him of being a little bitch? Because he's almost in range here, so as soon as he's in range, he'll be just unloaded on and destroyed by my guys. Let's pull back. He has been accused, and he is melting like butter. Beautiful. Hellstorms. Let's again just keep switching targets on what you guys are focusing on. As they were, they were waiting for the reinforcements. Not going to really matter all that much. Yeah, there we go. Loki is now dead. Look, okay, Elspeth again to just keep pushing forward to keep just harassing them as they make their try and make their way towards us. Like, it's been a while since I've actually gotten into melee with any of my infantry, uh, my guns. Also, this is the first time that this uh, unit's been in battle now, so I'm curious. So, it does not take that long to get the intensity up. So, he's there at about 70% right now with 300 kills. So, that's actually pretty decent. Like, that, that goes up really nicely. Doesn't showcase over here, though. But I do see the reserves continuously going up there. Okay. Keep casting into the Lord there. Because we just want to have it so they will focus him down. Try and get some defenses. Just keep casting to him. It doesn't matter what we cast. We just need to keep casting. So as long as we cast around here, we get the intensity up. Yeah, no, you guys get that up really quickly, honestly. It's just interesting that it doesn't showcase over here. It's just not showing up on that side there that I'm getting all that stuff. Yeah, I can tell the thing, it just doesn't reflect on the power recharge thing, but it is working. So, interesting. So, with you, you you maxed out around like 500 kills, I think it was. So, yeah, having three of those, oh man, we will have so much magic to work with with uh, Elspeth. Because that's uh, 0.3 per second, which is pretty damn nice. Like, it, it takes me six for my one ability... So that it, it takes like 18 seconds, roughly, to get back, or 20, 20. Every 20 seconds, I can just keep cast. I'll have enough Winds of Magic to endlessly keep casting that ability, which, oh, what's the recharge on that, actually? I think it's almost actually the exact same amount of time it takes for her recharge. So this army, <laughs> that's four guys. I feel sorry for any army that tries to get near me. They just die. Because, like, right now... Um, I haven't been getting as many... Okay, no, that's like still about a thousand. Just thousand schematics there. I'll get the replenishment since we are in enemy territory. A moment of I really need to keep fighting more Skaven. Skaven are such an amazing way to get more schematics. Which is why I will eventually give Lokir a ceasefire. Because for the most part right now, I don't need to fight him. Um, he's he's kind of getting his ass whooped by me. And so like, hey, give him enough territory. A guilt will the hopefully push him back. Hey, you want me to help against the... I'm not in position, but I will accept this. I will be, I will help you get rid of the wheels, because they are kind of kicking your ass. Uh, let me first get my army of steam tanks. <laughs> I want to have that army first before we decide to join and help them. It's like This army just got here. It is next turn. When you guys will be able to do that stuff. Um, I do need to make sure you keep increasing the capacity of wizards here, though. So let's remember to do that. And then I now finish this. Okay. Now we just need to get enough uh, schematics. And I can actually get all the ones I want in Elspeth's army. And now you will be able to start recruiting your stuff next turn. So now... Let's see. Does oh, that reduce cost for all spells? Oh, my, it reduce cooldown on all spells. Wizard, ward save. Because we're now at the point where now let's just kind of finish off all the rest of the stuff. 
Could try and get the stuff that gives you more money. Growth, replenishment rate. Uh, yeah, I just saw a 20% trade tariff. Yeah, let's do this. Let's let's go start getting this stuff down now. I probably should eventually get some of this stuff here as well. Oh, more trade resources, trade tariffs. Oh, man, yeah. I want more stuff like that. Immune to snow attrition, all armies. Oh, that's new. I like that. What are we if we do okay. not advance? Elspeth, though. <laughs> well, I maybe actually be able to get all the fights she needs. Because you can just walk over here and just we slaughter these guys. Might actually, I might be able to. Let's grab the replenishment. Because this didn't, this isn't going down. Why is it not going down? <laughs> Interesting. Lady of uh, hit the bamboo crossing. Raise Occupy that. That's not counted, which is stupid. Rider but there we go. The so now, am I able to give him? Bamboo Crossing. I hate that it has to like be right next to them to be able to give it to them. I trust our dealings will yeah, I need to teleport back to help you. Friend. Let's see. So I can give you Bamboo Crossing. So I will give you Bamboo Crossing. As you say, sir. And then I should be able to now... Yep, now I can give you this village. There we go. I'm not going to ask for money for that. So I'll give you guys that. And then I should probably teleport over with Elspeth now. Amethyst just to make sure that if because they have a lot of troops right here if they attack here right now um that could be an issue so let's teleport over here hello <laughs> how's it go deathmaster because now i think because i'd want to push back here basically because it should be that I, because they border if they border this territory i can give him this and then all this stuff yeah so that should work right now gelt is getting stronger we're getting in there Elspeth now will just help push back you guys a little bit. Let's see. Yeah, the bounce power there is okay. But we've got you here. Because, let's see. Um, you can experience gain. Cavalry. Statesmen. Leader of men. Oh, wait. Now, actually, now that I think about it, this army needs to be led by a... Oh, shit. No, actually, yeah. Well, for you right now... Um... No, I need to actually... Yeah, I want you to be a Master Engineer, actually, now that I think about it. It'll be better if you're the one leading this army. Because you can get all the stuff for... Yep, the reload, the reduced uh, upkeep, and then also just the uh, range on all the units. Yep. Yep. I'm going to go with that. With that idea. So we'll go with this. So plans to this, this. Upgrade artillery pieces there. And then you, you'll still be fine there for right now. Uh, you just keep sitting there in defensive stance for right now. Jurgen, you need to just keep watching over this area a little bit until it's actually happier. Uh, we do need to repair this stuff. Just waiting for this corruption to go away, and then I'll destroy this. Uh, do get the... I probably will want the control building around here. Uh, I feel like... But for right now, just get growth just to make it so it's a bit easier to build this area up. Alrighty, we actually have an underway interception here. Um, I'm going to just take this, uh, seeing as how Elspeth is nearby. Uh, I lose units that I don't really care too much about. The only unit I care about is this Demigrip Knight, because I don't want to lose him, because I just spent all the time here recruiting him on purpose. So, let's do that, and then just give me more schematics. Whatever helps us get more schematics is what we want right now. And now I can have it so that Elspeth, she's going to be able to keep pushing forward. Um, I think we can try and have it so... I think this other army that I have here, because I, I, I will eventually have it be the force that is the Doomstack of Wizards and Hellstorm Rocket Batteries. I think for right now, what we'll do Dark is I can take some more time to recover. <laughs> Fuck. I'm going to have to give up the crown, I know, here soon in a second anyways. So that will hopefully help fix all of these public order penalties. Not all public order, I mean diplomatic relations. Um, also, I, was found, I did find another guy with uh, Hodgelin Scopes. So I found another one there, which is really nice for us. Is there another one here, possibly? Please. Please. Nope. I only have two at the moment, anyways. So just wait until next turn. Okay, now it went down. I don't know why I didn't go down that uh, other turn. Um, but no, for right now, at least. Uh, I want you. So this is what I'll do for right now. I'm going to go here. You need to switch out. So you for you. Switch those out. 
That way then Elspeth now has the other CAV unit she's going to have in her army. And we will slowly get rid of them. Um, when I can, when I have... Actually, I have enough right now, actually. So, if we go over here, get another one of these. Yeah, I need about 4,000, like I thought. So then I'm going to get rid of you. And then... I am not able to get them around here. Ah, oh, that's annoying. I have to take this territory back. That's fine. I'll be down one unit for a little bit, but that's okay. Um, so let's keep pushing forward to try and take the thing of Elemental Winds. And then I'm going to have you... I feel like I'm going to turn you around. In pursuit of knowledge. Yeah, you can't even in encampment stance right now. Is this the correct ratio? Now you do have global. Yeah, because I think what I might do with you... Ooh, actually, we need to make sure we save our money for right now. Because now I can go back to this other army of mine that I'm trying to make. Right here. Now you! <laughs> get all the steam tanks. So, what I want... Let's see, so I have plenty... I have plenty of land ships, I feel like. I might get, like, one more. But I do want to have, like... Try and four of these, two of these, so that way I have two and two. And then I'll be getting rid of these guys now. Actually, maybe I could have kept them. That's fine. Maybe we should try and put some Hodgson's rifles in here. Have those. But no, it needs to be just tanks. Steam tanks and land ships. That's all I want it to be. So we need three slots for that. We should just get one more of each then. So one of you, one of you, and one of you. That is this army. <laughs> it costs an arm and a leg, but it's an army of just tanks and steam uh, and, uh, land ships. Which I'm going to find fun. This is going to be uh, fun to have this army in here. Actually, I don't have a engineer in here. Hmm, I probably should get an engineer here. So, because we can have someone perceptive and someone that's fleet-footed. There was a bonus, the one that we had specifically for other stuff. So we can hold off on that since it's going to be four turns of recruitment anyways. So, you're fine there. And then, let's see. This guy will now be put on auto-manage. I don't need to focus on you anymore. Yeah, you need to upgrade this stuff, and then I'll have you get corruption reduction. If you want you guys, okay, so the person in front, you're the one that's technically going to be considered the person that's using their stuff for this ability. Um, everybody else, My just focus on magic. Serve. That's that's all you guys will focus on is just magic. Because we want to make it so that we have all of you guys that appear. So we want to be able to make it so we max out that elemental mastery with you guys, and then you just guys just continuously cast shit basically. So you guys will be good there. And then Jurgen right now, you're still sitting over here. So many I'll probably be having you sit here a little bit longer. Yeah, two more turns at least. Oh man, we're about to lose these crowns soon here. Oh, Clan Morris is dead. More uh, tradable goods and campaign moon range. I like that. Okay, six minutes. We're boarded there. Okay. Back over here now though. Let's see. So, Elspeth... You should have no issue really pushing in here. Yeah, this is just a, a generic garrison there. That other army is in range. If I could hit them, that'd be great. But for right now, yeah, now I can get it. So now I can get the other Hellstorm rocket battery that I wanted here. And then I just need to save up enough so I can replace this one as well. God, this army is disgusting. I love it. Okay, but you know, you guys do that. Uh, I'm going to have you just keep sitting here for right now. Uh, this army, though, I will have you sit here. Only the best. Try and get some guys in here. Because I'll try and have it so we have, basically, at least... We'll have five Hellstorm rocket batteries. That are the Amethyst ones in here. Then we'll have this, and then the rest will just be you guys. Why not? We can do that. Maybe you have some guns in there. I don't know. We'll have to see about that. But for now, at least, we'll just fill up this army. Because I want to have you turn around at some point, to kind of push back here and help give more land over to Gelt, basically. Because that's that's the whole point of our expedition here, is just to build Gelt up, basically. Um, you can go on to auto-manage now at this point in time. Scotty! And then that's basically almost every single hero I have now fully on auto-manage in at least Elspeth's army. So, you guys are good there. I need to keep just checking on that every once in a while, because I, I still want to try and have it, because I want to also help out against these... Uh, no, you guys don't have any, so let's Engineer. get you. 
disband. If I see the one that uh, gives me reduced upkeep and reco recovery for uh, like steam engines and stuff like that, I'll put that in this army. But for right now, keep just trying to find the Hotchin scopes because I'd like to make that army and then uh, have that go against the orcs down here. Yeah, I feel bad that you guys keep just throwing these guys over here, and this is an army that, again, I don't mind losing troops in this, so if, I, if this is going to guarantee that you guys are not going to be able to affect Gelt, I'll gladly take it. So do that, and then I'll just get more schematics here, because you guys are going to be recovering anyways. So we'll just have you guys do that, because now, at this point in time, I will be able to start pushing Elspeth forward once again. I'll try and have it so that she is going to start trying to push forward into the lands of the Skaven now. So we can start trying to destroy Deathmaster. And I feel like, honestly, we don't need to stay here for too much longer. We just need to build up Gelt just enough. And then I will be leaving Cathay, coming back, and probably, I feel like when I leave Cathay, that's like when we start the end game of like us trying to finish this campaign. Because at this point in time, like, so quests I actually have, let's see, for victory, do not actually have, I thought I had something related to, no I don't. I actually technically still also do not actually have enough regions, actually. Loot, uh, occupy, loot, razor, sack, 70 different unique settlements. I actually still haven't done that yet. Um, I just don't have Hotchland, which is, again, that's just, like, Hotchland over there. Oh, no, it's only Hotchlands that I don't have. I thought we had to have the land over here as well. Ostermark is not considered in that long victory conditions. Interesting. I thought it was. Okay. Well, so. we'll keep trying to check and see if I can find the engineers I want. Loot sapper? No, it's not. Yeah, so we don't have any of the ones I want. So just grab a guy and disband him immediately. So you can do that. And then over here, I think Jurgen. Yeah, Jurgen can probably start moving down now. I'm going to get rid of this. You have that be the public order building. And then Jurgen over here. Oh. I didn't realize that was uh, messed up. So he'll have to actually sit here for two more turns. Then he can move out. Uh, on that right now, going back over to Elspeth. So Elspeth here. Right you the need to now start pay pushing forward. So the way we're going to want to go about this is I think we should push to this territory first, technically. Uh, this guy's going to be recruiting for three more turns. I can then have him kind of move somewhere. Um, actually, look at you. you just grab more guys while you're sitting here. Yeah, grab those. Just keep recruiting. But yeah, Lady Elspeth, we can kind of, I guess, push up here, go around. But if I go over here first, I can actually give that territory over to Gelt. Yeah, and no, I was trying to do that. Let's try and make my way over to Shilong. She'll take me two turns to get over there for, and then we'll have to see how that's going to go. Yeah, don't be an idiot. Do not just turn around. Just keep pushing forward through them, because you can. Keep doing that. And then I have all the rank-ups from you, which for you will have uh, Hone Steel be the other one you do, so that way you have the mainly this. It's mainly going to be the Hellstorms in your army is the main thing that you're doing. And then all of these guys, honestly, I can probably just put you guys onto Automatic immediately because I know you're, the, the wizards are all going to be doing the same thing. So I'm just going to have you guys all be upgraded to just do, well, no, I don't want you to be idiots and waste points. Compelled by good sense. Because we just want to get you guys as quickly up through your casting as possible. So that way you guys can all get the spells I want when this army is going to be so set up. Ideas. So like, do, 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 just keep doing that. The faction has been destroyed. Not opposed to that. And then do I almost, so I'm almost done with this uh, recruitment over here. Because it'll be one more turn. Yeah, one more turn. Then I'm gonna send this over to the elves and we're gonna start trying to kill them off. Um, let's check again here for the engineers. Nope, none of the ones I want. Again, so just keep getting you guys, disbanding you until we find the ones that we want. Either Hotchland Scopes or the one that gives me the bonuses for my Siege Engines. This army, however, here, you'll be able to move out next turn. But for right now, let's get you guys the growth, uh, the public order building around here. Because I'm probably going to need that with you guys having the Skaven. Uh, let's see, back over here. Elspeth, though. Dark lady. Yeah, ignore them. Just keep going for Shilong. Just keep going for the territories. Because that's the whole point of this is right now. Is just spread out conquer and give as much land over to Gelt at this point in time. Two more turns until I lose the crown, which I mm, I feel like I am going to have to actually give it up. I'm going to be sad about that because I've been having a lot of fun with it, but too, too many people are going to get pissed off because I have it. One more turn and I have to give away the crown. Oh, Sword of Kate has been claimed by... Mm, that's not good. Let's see. Ah, oh, there we go. More trade tariffs. Yes, please. 
Yeah, because at this point in time, I feel like... Okay, this is probably going to make... Oh, uh, no. I can have it so we can keep doing a little bit more for today. Because I was about to say, I want to do make sure I still do one more fight, at least with Elspeth, just to showcase what her army looks like now at this point in time. Which actually... And now that I took another territory, I have just enough to get one more of these fuckers to replace you. Because this is fair and balanced. Because, <laughs> oh my god. Yes, yeah, so now I have three of these things. I should now effectively have, well, like, literally unlimited. Well, yeah, what is the cooldown again on? Cooldown on that is 16 seconds. So literally, if I wait four seconds after this cooldown of this thing, I will have generated enough uh, from you guys that I can always keep casting that spell. That is disgusting. Also, this reset again. Oh my god. Why? When does it go up? It doesn't specify when it goes up for the amount of turns you have for it. Uh, don't tempt me to keep... I'm tempted to keep the fucking thing. Because it's such a fun ability to have on, honestly. Like, I, pro I shouldn't. I know I shouldn't. But I'm so tempted to. Uh, I should now remember, though. So, if I join on in against the Wood Elves... God, fucking everybody hates me. They're not allied with each other. Yeah, attitude of everybody hates me. No, you guys actually still like me a little bit. The dwarves do. The forces, yeah, you guys don't as much. But the well, the dwarves and humans love me. I could keep the crown. <laughs> if I can, I'm gonna honestly try to. Give me a second, bud. Give me a second. Let me get in position. I'm moving Jurgen. My uh my steam tank army's moving out next turn. Uh, since I just I just grabbed a, a random engineer. I mean, I haven't been able to find the one I really want just yet. So I'm just gonna start moving them out. Once they're in position, then I will help you guys. Because I, I do want to fight them. But for right now, uh, Mysterious Meat. That's this guy. You're still recruiting right now, so you're fine. As the Empire, you still have one more turn for right now. Uh, Elspeth, though. Amethyst mage. Again, so we'll give over a Shilong here in a second. But let's just keep going up around. Let's hit the Bridge of Heaven next. This one I actually want to showcase, this fight. Just because. Because uh, this territory here... Should be able to give you that. Yep, Shilong. As long as I can give you the territory, that's all good. Because I just want to keep growing you, getting you to be stronger around here. But I think, let's have this be the last thing we do for today. I just want to, no, it's not even, it's a, such a small army. Like, I want to showcase the proper might of these guys. So let's just keep occupying some more crap. And I want to find somebody to fight to showcase this. Because at this point in time, I feel like Elspeth can just keep walking all over uh, anybody around here. Which is probably accurate. Um, I do still need to have her get enough that I can put in another Ironside unit in here. But we'll have to hold off on that. That costs right now... How much is that for you to get one of those guys? 2,000. I really need to stop recruiting these guys if I want to actually upgrade and finish everybody else's stuff over here. Which I probably should do. Especially, like, make sure I get the stuff here and here... But once I start fighting with other people, then we'll get more uh, schematics as well. Oh no, a wa failed. Such a bad thing for us. Okay, back over here. Let's have it so... Ooh, we have a mission. What's that mission for? You put this, so uh, capture and occupy the following settlement. Yeah, <laughs> fuck it. Sure, I'm not opposed to that. Elspeth here. Oh my god, there's so many agents following us around Lady right now. Elspeth here... Not able to hit anybody I want to. Although I can just hit more stuff over here. Like, we just need to take territory. I think this might be enough. Yeah, let's do this. I'm going to do this, and I want to do this fight myself, just so we can see what it's like having all of these Amethyst Hellstorm rocket batteries now. Because this is just mean. This this is literally just mean. I now have unlimited, effectively unlimited. As long Like, if I'm casting... um. The single target ability, I think that's even cheaper. Because I get about... Yeah, in, in, in 20 seconds, I get 6. So every minute, I get 18. At once, it's maxed. So every minute, I should get about 18 Winds of Magic. And as long as I am casting something like every less than 20 seconds... Because, like, how much does that cost again? I think it's, like, 4. Like, oh, no... There's people here. I'm just gonna have my guns get set up over here immediately. Because you guys can just get set up over here immediately. Gun down this spot. 
Elspeth and everybody else in their own little groups. You guys can just get set up there. And then I actually now have cavalry now, so we properly have some actual cav. But Hellstorms just just stay there and support Elspeth here. Because this thing costs... Yeah, this costs four. This is now just mean. Especially since they have that like, AoE thing on top of them as well. So not only do they have... Are you guys going to fire? Oh, no, they are. It's just I wasn't able to easily see them enough. Yeah, because they fire the little balls. Like right there, there, there. Elspeth hit the manticores. And then we can just see... Well, we'll notice when they start getting enough kills when this thing just starts piling up. Yeah, because literally just, like, unload into this area. It's almost like this is actually an issue now that I have this one, because I need to, like, get as many kills on these ones first so that I can actually properly make the most out of uh, everything here. Because, like, you guys... Well, it's getting up there. Yeah, 17%. 16%. This entire army's dead already. Like, it, it goes to show... Oh, you guys actually hit us with something. Yeah, they're trying, but no, I, I just love the fact that... This... Having three of these now... Because it gets up to 80%. Up to 80% eventually. With all of that there. That, uh, per... 80% uh, per for the recharge. So we'll get it rapidly... And then it's just the reserves is the main other thing. is like, oh, how quickly that stuff goes up. Like, I'm not even worrying about you guys. Like, you guys technically have a minute to get on the map here still. And Elspeth is just slaughtering you guys still. Like, the Lord here. Just get in melee there and finish them off. Because they'll be, they're just about done here. Yeah, they're just casting their arc stuff onto us here. Yeah, finish off that uh, Manticore. Yeah, just wait, await reinforcements. Let's get you guys to rotate over this way. Yeah, that's all they're doing is just casting that stuff onto you guys. Are those things not dead? They should be. I have to try and unload into you guys here. Yeah, they're getting a lot of this, the things from their arcs off, and that's about it. Otherwise, it's like, it's not that bad, although I do need to actually get you guys in here to help out. Because, like, I'm hoping we'll still get a decent amount of recovery uh, after... Ooh. Just to be careful. I am getting cocky here. Yeah, Hellstorms, if you're going to, make sure you fire into the backline area, not right up in front where everyone is. As long as you fire in the back, that's fine. You know, got a little cocky, but no, that's fine. It, it is just great to see that, like, this is the endgame army for Elspeth. There's only one other army I would maybe kind of want to try and make, but I think we're getting close to the point where, like, we'll finish up and finally end this campaign soon. I, again, I still think like episode 15 is probably going to be the last episode for this campaign. Because with me focusing, now that things have been stabilized a little bit more around here, it'll be a lot easier for me to just keep giving territory over to Balthazar Gelt. And once he's got like control of like all of Cathay, I can just leave. I can just leave. He'll be able to defend himself, hopefully. That's the hope. Because we're just trying to stabilize the Empire. We want to stabilize the Empire and play around with all the big exploding uh, do not touch gun things from the gunnery school, which I'm having a lot of fun with. Especially just given the fact like, the army that I will be able to make with the uh, landmark in the elemental winds area is just going to be interesting. But yeah, let's have you guys get to yeah, grab that replenishment. And then we can take Nong Shang here. The immortal crown. <laughs> is this the highest level of it? Keep the crowd. Fuck it. Cannot be improved any further. So it is, yep, five levels to the crown. Elspeth Interesting. I love it. I, protect the Empire. I love it, I love it, I love it. Because now at this point in time, let's see. So first and foremost, let me just give them over more territory. To my so I want to give you Bridge of Heaven, because I think I can give you this territory. Because I know I can give you the Bridge of Heaven. And then am I able to... I cannot... I hate that I can't give you this one, actually. Not from where I'm at currently. I'm going to just abandon the area next turn, basically, then. I don't want them to control it. Because I just can't give it to you right now, which is the weird bullshit. Well, maybe if I take Shemaya's Rest, I can. Possibly. Um, 
we'll have to see about that. But I think for now, I think we'll be done for today. I think we'll be done for today, seeing as how at this point in time, I've been able to start g actually giving some proper land over to Balthazar. Um, this army can now start moving now. So he'll be able to start moving. I can have him start applying some pressure over here as well to possibly give more territory over to Balthazar Gelt. Again, if I just get him a big enough chunk of the Cathay, I think he can defend himself. But I think I'll be done for right now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you guys did, let me know down in the comments down below. Love what you guys have to say about this campaign. Any thoughts about in general? This is Rampant. I'll see you guys next time. He'll be able to start moving. I can have him start applying some pressure over here as well to...